I would say financial literacy is the ability to understand how much money you have and the best way to spend and or save it. I think just really understanding what you're doing and how your actions influence what may happen to you later. Protecting your money, using it wisely, and planning for the future. Financial education has been around for a long while, but I think in the last 10 years or so, there have been events in the world that have sensitized people to understand the consequences of bad financial decisions. There's just an overwhelming amount of information. Things move very quickly, and I think that a foundation in financial literacy helps them understand, first off, how to filter out the noise. Having a high school in the hustle and bustle of the big city is definitely a challenge. There are so many things to do. There are so many things to see, and there are so many things to get involved in. For the students at this age to become financially literate, understand money management, credit card debt, how to save, it will help them in the long run. Teaching personal finance is one of the most important things I do. They know what a bank account is, or they know what a credit card is, but they really don't know the specifics. I always knew you should save. I never really thought about how much per month you should do if you're looking at a budget. I got my first you know, official job this year, and I had to fill out a W-2, and we had just covered that unit in econ. Personal finance was really all of my knowledge of taxes came from that class, and it's been very helpful this yeah. year. I try to make everything as relevant as possible to their lives, and that's not too difficult to do because we're talking about money. As we provide financial education for young people, we're also building them to be future employees. We're building them to adults that can actually reach some of their aspirations and their goals. And I talked to my parents about it, and it was just really interesting looking to see from their perspective as people who have made and used budgets for years uh, what they spend the money they make on because it so directly affects me. And yet, really until that point, I had no concept of what, what are my parents doing with the money they make? Who knows? WISE is raising awareness of the critical need of financial literacy, and it's helping educators, policymakers, etc., understand that personal finance is not just the purview of adults, but that young people rapidly increase their knowledge and their ability to master the subject. Each year, we measure how well students are doing. We have a standardized national exam that is comprehensive. The students, when they do well, they should really feel good and be excited because they are financially literate. The WISE test is Virginia Board of Education approved, which means that not only is it a credential that is aligned with economics and personal finance, but it also satisfies another graduation requirement, which is that every student who graduates from a school in the Commonwealth must have an industry certification. It is an awesome feeling when we get to the end of the semester and the students do well on that test. My name is Joyce Cully. I am the personal finance and economics teacher here at Galileo Magnet High School in Danville, Virginia. Before the class, we knew certain stuff, but we didn't know we stuff knew, like, that we needed to We should after. budget, like, did we budget? No. no. Did we save? Nah. Like many communities, that had sort of an industrial base as their economic pipeline, we are transitioning and transforming into an informational-based economy. We use WISE as the one certificate that we ensure all students earn, and those companies have been excited to see that we require financial literacy as part of our curriculum. I don't think many kids realize the importance of the class until you get in there, until you sit down, and you start to actually figure out what everything is, and then you're like, wow, Thank you, WISE. This is going to be helpful for the rest of me now. WISE makes my life easier as a principal because it ensures that classroom instruction matches the Virginia standards of learning and their competency requirements. WISE provides the toolkit, the curriculum, the testing, and the measurable metrics around students' improvement. There is something going on here. Kids are listening. We are making a difference. Kids are getting into places where they never even considered before. And when you introduce what's out there, they want to achieve it. For the last three years, we have been named as one of the 100 best. Our students have done exceptionally well, and we're very proud of them. Having the 100 best ranking is helping change the dialogue around what is important to focus on for young people in school. It shows people not only at 
your jobs, but just like your friends and your surrounding environment, people that, hey, yeah, I know finances like that and I know how to work my money. And you can also help your family members out, like I was talking about my little sister. Like, I can help her out if she's struggling now because I have taken this class. To start in high school and to introduce them to the terminology and introduce them to some of the concepts is absolutely critical. We have a school of future business leaders, of future CEOs. It's a great honor to be included in this 100 top schools. So I'd like to congratulate all of the schools on the 100 best list this year for really being the best in the country. My sister was talking about opening a credit card and how easy it would be because she'd only have to pay the minimum every month and I was like, stop right there. <laughs> That's how you get yourself into trouble. Thanks to WISE, thanks to economics, I helped, I helped save a life. A <laughs> save life? A life. <laughs> I saved a life. Yes, I did. <laughs>